it was in the year 1999 when I got admitted to St. Augustine School, Kalimpong, and I gave my ICC in 2012. That makes a total of 13 years that I've spent exactly in the school. This used to be the same way I used to go back home every single day at 3 o'clock except for the weekends. And this year, our dear St. Augustine School, Kalimpong, completes 75 years of its existence. That is, it is the Platinum Jubilee year for St. Augustine School, Kalimpong. And well, out here in this primary section, I have spent my six years. That's right, six freaking years of my life I have spent out here. Six freaking years I have spent in this exact primary section of St. Augustine School, Kalimpong. And I'm here back after almost a year. The last time I came here was during the Sosonian Alumni Day of 2019. If you haven't watched the vlog yet, then I'll put the link of the vlog here. Go and check it, because that day it was so much fun. But this year, due to the pandemic, we are not going to experience anything of that sort. But I thought, this is the 75 years of St. Augustine School, so why not just, you know, take you guys on a tour of our beloved school, or alma mater. Come, let's start with the vlog. And this is the basketball court where I learned how to play basketball. Brings back a lot of memories this place. An entire childhood. We were here since we were small kids. We left this place as adults. Wow, this is the same exact spot where we used to play basketball. And numerous times what used to happen was a ball used to get stuck in here. Any of the Sasonians know this or have or this thing has happened to you in the past, comment down below. Exactly out here, a ball used to get stuck. 1999 was the year, and this was my class, UKGA. Out here. Class 1 is probably in the first floor, I guess. Oi! Class 1 mati tala mati hai, paila? Class 1 yo. Okay, class 1 is out here. 1B is here. 2000 was the year when I was in this class, class 1A. So when I was in class 1, this guy was in UKG. A bulletin board, right? Matterhorn, Kanchenjunga, Everest, Fujiyama. Just walking through the corridor and reliving all those childhood memories of mine. I can't really explain how many times I have slept out here during my school days, during the lunch time, the break time, whenever this entire bench used to be free, I used to come here just lie down for the sake of lying down. There are many more instances that define a Sosonian's life in St. Augustine School. Thinking of all those good times just makes me smile and wonder if I have a son of my own in the future then he is coming to the same school. Class 3A, 3C, okay where is class 3A then? Oof. This is class 2A. Okay. I don't know whether class 2A used to be here when I was in school or not, but I'm not being able to find class 3A. Probably it's somewhere out there. Let's go and check once again. Nope, class 3A ain't out here. And when I was in school, that used to be class 5A. The last year of my in the primary section of St. Augustine School, Kalimpo, in the year 2004, that is 16 years back. This at the time used to be class 5A, that 5B and out there 5C. And Mr. Photographer is here. And this is how the primary section of St. Augustine School, Kalimpo looks like. 
क्लास फाइव ए इज आउट हियर क्लास फाइव पी एंड क्लास फाइव सी आउट दे एल के जी इज आउट दे वेन आई फर्स्ट ज्वाइन ए सी एस क्लास एल के जी डिट एग्जिस्ट बट बिफोर आई ज्वाइन ए सी एस क्लास एल के जी डिट एग्जिस्ट एंड आफ्टर आई ज्वाइन ए सी एस क्लास एल के जी डिट एग्जिस्ट बट एट द टाइम वेन आई ज्वाइन ए सी एस एल के जी डिट एल के जी डिट एग्जिस्ट एंड दिस सी यूज टू बी आर टॉयलेट इट्स स्टिल आर टॉयलेट ओ दे हैव ऑल टाइल्स एंड ऑल वेन वी आर यूर देन इट वॉज जस्ट वेवर इज अट नोज दैट राइट This used to be a canteen area. Canteen. For so many years, we have sat out there in those very benches, those concrete ones, out there, those ones, and we have had a lunch out here. Now let's go to the second floor. Got to take you, folks. Come, let's go. Kidding. Bengali class. Okay. Here we used to have class four when we were in school. Okay. Class four C. Class four B. Here was the class I spent the year two thousand three in. That was class four A. This place brings back a lot of memories. I know I have said this multiple times in this very video itself, but it really does. Wow. And how can I forget this place? Don't tell anyone. I have had a couple of fights right here in this very place, and once I even fell from these stairs from here to there. <laughs> Happens in a boys' school, right? These small events, such as fighting, playing wrestling cards. Well, many of you might agree, many of you won't, but deep inside, each and every one knows that this is the thing. That will exist in a boys' school, not just boys' school, in any school. Wow! So these are how things are. How much things have changed over the past few years. I'm not going to be precisely telling how many years it has been, but few years. I guess that should solve the puzzle, right? Earlier, when we were in school, out here, none of this existed. Even that wasn't there when we were in this very class. We used to have this big blackboard, and when we reached secondary section, boards like that, green boards came into existence. And after we finished school, up around two or three years after we finished our high school, they came into existence. Those were just fancy technologies we used to hear when we were in school. But then after we finished. Our juniors, our fellow Sasonian brothers, they got to experience that, and now it seems they have a CCTV camera too. <laughs> Thank God we just finished school before that came into existence. Otherwise, our school life would have been much harder than what it was back then. If I'm not wrong, here it used to be a store room, but we used to call this the dark room, like the dark night. And you know what our aunties and all they used to tell us out here. If we become very naughty, if we are very mischievous, then they would lock us in that dark room for an entire day, and that would scare the shit out of us for real. And this is the new block that has been added. When we were in school, there used to be a small, not a small passage. There, we, there used to be huge stairs which would lead to the hostel compound of Saint Augustine's. That would basically connect the hostel and the primary section of the school. This entire thing is new. Five eight eight that's what it is. Um, bro, look at the decks, bro. So neat and tidy. Class five A used to be the time when Ma'am Chiringla used to be a class teacher, 
and before she used to come to the class, you know what we had to do? We had to get up like this, okay, and then we had to recite tables from 2 till I guess 15 or 16. And by the time she used to come, and actually that was a very good thing because after that, after reciting tables every day before a teacher came, that kind of stuck into our heads and because of that we could never forget the tables even if we wanted to forget them. So that cleared a lot of base for mathematics. Cheers to Mem Chiringla and her classes. English one, social studies, maths, value education, art. Okay, value education teacher, Mr. Justin Rai. He used to be a teacher, a wonderful teacher, a gem of a person. I don't know where he is right now, but I will never be able to forget a teacher like him. Although he just taught us for one year, but that one year was an experience of a lifetime. Bell rings and this is actually the happiest moment of a student, right? Chutti! <laughs> wow. Yes, to listen, Ambo. See this. I thought we had to open this, but it's like this. <laughs> Silly me, right? And the Ami part of the nail KG that didn't exist in India, no, bro? Yeah, because I joined, college, um, I joined school in UKG. Yeah, that was in the year 2000 because I joined in 1999 UKG. Yeah. And we used to have those wooden decks. Yeah, I did, no, bro. They have all these things out here. When we were in school, everything used to be so plain and yeah, white. Yeah, right? class, yeah, smart class or I mean, the school talk here after we finished school, around two or three years later, smart class was introduced. No, when we were in school, we didn't even have these green boards, we had these black boards. Yeah, when we were in small, when we were small, we had black boards, but when we came to secondary section, we had green boards in the Tibella. But these things, they were just wild imaginations with when we were in school, right? We could only imagine those things, and now everything has turned into reality. So many things have changed. I'll just let Mr. Photographer get done with his work. And I'm done with the primary school. Now it's time for me to head towards the secondary section. Let's go. So it's been over an hour since the last time I came in front of the camera. And well, it's 2.20 p.m. to be precise and the sun is directly hitting my eyes. So basically what is the plan for now is heading towards secondary section to get done with all the shoot that is necessary out there. And once that gets done, the vlog is over. <laughs> and today I have the keys to everything. This guy has the keys to everything today. So at first I thought that this guy was making an entire cinematic video of this school, but later I came to know that it's actually a virtual tour. Right, bro? Yeah. Not a cinematic video for now. Not a cinematic video for now. But anyway, the link of his virtual tour will be down in the description box. Go and check it. Show some love and support. That's all we demand. <laughs> demand for you. Demand they also, hey bro. Yeah. All he can do is sometimes you can demand certain things from you folks, right? No, because it doesn't cost you guys anything. Yeah, exactly. A little bit of appreciation doesn't cost us anything. Cost you anything, basically, not us. We have a lot of hard work and labor. On you. Hello, Dazu. Here we have different kinds of birds. For the folks who don't know this, this is the hostel block of St. Augustine's School Kalimpong. Down there, the principal's office, the bursar's office, and account section. Here, here we have CR Hall, the Canon regular hall. This is the place where I learned how to play table tennis. That was in the year 2005 when I was in the 6th standard. Everything is so empty right now. Last year when we came out here, there was this statue of St. Augustine's and a lot of decorations basically. This year, nothing at all. Nothing. Walking through the corridors of library. Oh, here is the library. This is the computer lab right now. This is the library. 
spent a ton of silence out here. <laughs> this used to be an audio visual room. Still the band room. This is the new edition, the new block. Class 11 and class 12. This is class 12 science. Class 12 humanities, okay, when we were in school, humanities didn't exist. But now they have humanities as well. This is class 12 commerce. This entire block is like freshly constructed. So when we were in school, there used to be class 12 science. And below that used to be 12 commerce. And as I told you, class 12 humanities didn't exist. language room this thing didn't exist this used to be class 12 science that exact room class 10 C yeah this used to be class 10 C 2009 was the year so the classroom that you see behind me used to be my classroom when I was in 9th standard that was in the year 2008 who was my class teacher back then it was Mr. Francis Tamang Mr. Francis Prakash Tamang Mr. F.P. Tamang There used to be a toilet and it's still a toilet washroom basically and this thing didn't exist back then This is the trademark of St. Augustine's this entire painting that you see on the stairway Lady staff room like it always was. This is the gent staff room. This is like the art gallery of the boys who have graduated from the school in different years. Out here we have the IEC 2012 patch and here is your Sasunian Priyam, the bomb from the hills. Walking through this corridor. Vice Principal's office. Earlier this used to be Principal's office when we were like little kids. Games room, Sayiho. I have been seeing this exact poster since the past three years. This is the third year in a row. The reunion of 2018 was the time when I first came here after a very long time. I, see, I had seen this. 2019, a oh, memorable year. Again, I had come during the school day. I had seen that. And this year, 2020, during the pandemic. I see that again. Class 8, 2007. There we used to have a chemistry lab, out there we used to have a thing, biology lab, there we used to have a physics lab. Stuff common room, I still didn't get it. I still didn't get why is it called a stuff common room. And look, we have found Silasa. So just drinking a cup of water. Normally we drink a glass of water, right? But right now I'm drinking a cup of water. So where are we at this particular moment is staff common room. Earlier I was having some trouble understanding what this ex what this room was for. But after talking to Leo Daju, I came to know that this is where the teachers meet up during the lunch time to have their lunch or during the tea time and have the tea. Just a chit chat kind of a room. Okay. There's always film anyway. So, guys, don't judge me. I'm just tired and hungry. If you are wondering where he learned to eat, <laughs> why we in that particular way, then look no further. It is out here in this very school itself. School basic again, the lesser again, no, Malimteo. We so soon had this unique way of eating, why we. That is directly put 
the packet inside your mouth and finish the entire thing. Get out of here. I'm going to go to the packet. I'm going to go to the packet. I'm going to go to the last one. फोर्थ ना फिफ्थ को मैंने चिकन दी थी पर दिन है क्या देना एक एक बाइट तो अंजेक हम वो ऐसे ले आने देंगे दो ले सके दी रहे हैं तो हम बड़ा मन बड़ा मन सो दैट इज़ हाउ वी लर्न इट एक्चुअली इट्स नॉट अ वीर्ड वे इट्स नॉट अ वीर्ड एक्चुअली इट्स नॉट अ वीर्ड वे एक्चुअली दिस इज़ द राइट वे द � <laughs> so this guy will be shooting his virtual tour of the secondary section now and well I'll be continuing with the vlog and I'll be I'll, I'll be showing you folks around the secondary section. Let's go. This way or that way? We came from that way, right? Let's go here. I don't know what that is because when this was constructed, I wasn't in school. Okay, here they have class 11 science. When we were in 11th standard, it used to be in the ground floor. 11 humanities out here, 11 commerce out here. We didn't have the pleasure of studying in this particular room but we had the pleasure of sitting on those benches. <laughs> Does that even make sense? That tap out there used to be your only source of drinking water and not just that, it even used to be a way to you know, skip classes during the middle of the classes. During our SABW classes, we used to remove all, we used to pluck all these unnecessary unwanted plants from this garden and we used to plow out here. A lot of memories of our school days. This exact tap. Hello sir, how are you? I'm good, sir. Yeah, sir. A trip down the memory lane. Surprisingly, even after the school being locked down for almost six months, that's half a year, the tap still has water. Isn't that great? In junior classes, what we used to do is we used to get our own lunch box. We used to get our own lunch boxes. We used to get our own bottle of water. But as we grew older, we thought of shedding that unnecessary weight of our backs and what we used to do is, we never used to carry our water bottles to our school. So what we used to do is, this tap used to be the only source of water. And not just that, when we used to feel boring during the classes, <laughs> we used to ask permission to come here and you know... The teacher used to think that we would come here to drink water but then we would take a tour of the entire school. But now when we think, teachers have been teachers have been through the same phase that we have. So when we used to make those stupid bahanas and come here to drink water, and we used to roam the entire school, they actually knew everything about it. Right sir, when we were in school, what we used to do is, we used to tell the teachers that we want to drink water and we used to come here, okay? After that we used to roam the entire school. But now when we think about it, our teachers already knew that we were actually roaming the school, right? But that time the teachers would act like, you know, we didn't know any of that. But now when you think about it, yeah, the teachers knew. Obviously we would take so much of time to drink water. Yeah. Take care, sir. Bye-bye. So let me just drink water from you. A trip down the memory lane, indeed. Dogs have done their thing. Class 7A, 2006 was the year. We used to play football out here with the bottle caps. 
<laughs> model caps what what else the pen cap sometimes even the pen the small pencils for that for the matter art room when we were in school this used to be class 7a and that used to be class 11 commerce but now they have converted this into the art room and that into class 6a yes class 7a sorry class 6 was out there this used to be 11 commerce this used to be 11 science hindi room or catechism room here we have spent 2010 in this class like 11 science 6 so you by the me it here that used to be 6a this used to be 6b it's still the same i really wish i had a bottle cap or something a <laughs> so on a piece of paper but i don't have any of my friends to do so if if those guys were here then probably we are then probably we would have done that stupid thing of playing football out here once again let's see next year probably the first year of my secondary section is 2005 6 standard 6a to be precise Here is the washroom. What else? Here there are beds. Who's going to sleep out here? But they have just left the rooms vacant out here. Probably the guys were in the construction down there. They probably they use this room. actually pretty hot this was constructed probably year before last year the dj hall diamond jubilee hall that was constructed when the school completed its 60 years of inauguration anyway this is the 75th year this was supposed to be a platinum jubilee year but because of the virus no celebrations will be happening this year and probably the next grand celebration will be held once the school completes us it's 100 years i'm going to be super old bro i don't know whether you can read that or not but it seems this was constructed for this year it's written platinum and jubilee to william sadly eh? i bet most of you guys are already planned to visit school during this 28 on the 75 years of competition but then covid ruined your plans covid ruined my plan too bro let's just hope everything gets settled down once once and for all and we get to we get to live back on normal lives this used to be a bulletin board we used to write news articles out here the establishment used to be a lawn tennis court but we used to play cricket here this now looks better than what it used to look when we were in school although it has been abandoned but now they can make use of this court once again cheers i'm trying to call silas up his phone is switched off and i don't know where to search for him cuz the school is pretty huge heading to which trends park Children's park didn't exist when we were in school, but a few of my cousins have already experienced what it feels like to be in the children's park of Saint Augustine's Kalimpong. 
and I'm pretty sure it's closed. Let's see. Let's go and find out. And I'm dead tired right now. And this here is the children's park of St. Augustine's Kalimpong. And out there is the swimming pool. Hang on, mate, I'm gonna take you to the swimming pool. And that's gonna be the place where we are gonna end the vlog. So that is how much effort it takes to create one simple vlog for you folks. This used to be a car parking and this probably is still the car, car, uh, still the car parking area of ACS. So this is the swimming pool of St. Augustine School Kanembong and as you can see if you enter, in this, enter into this pool right now, you are not gonna get out in one. Give us the right, one piece. So this was entirely about my today's vlog where I've tried to show the entire school in one particular video. I know this is not enough but I've tried my best. Well, at least I can see that. So thank you so much for making me a part of video. Until next time, that is uh, Silas, an uh, interior photographer, very good photographer. Do Check out his channel on YouTube, check out his Instagram, everything will be in my description box out there. And this is your Priyam Gurung and I will see you very very soon. Till then, bye bye, take care and cheers to life. Thank you so much. Good night. Ciao. And happy school day to each and everyone watching once again. The Mandial. Happy school day, happy 75th celebration to all the Sasonians. Worldwide. In India and all over the world. Ciao. S-A-S-R-S-A